do look funky as a slow thing. Okay, next shot. And here we go. I wanted to do this shot in England, but I couldn't because of the livestock restrictions on uh, moving pigs around. So I went to Poland and I hired a trailer load of pigs for 60 pounds. And we just did that in a national park. There were joggers going by and lovers and all the rest of it. And we had a trailer load of piglets. It was very funny. But note the poison mushroom in our hands. So who's the poison mushroom for? Is it for itself or the pig? Mm. Okay, next image is. This is my last one in the series. This is all shot in camera. There's going to be a DVD of, uh, coming out about this later in the year. In fact, beginning of next year. Um, all about the making of this series. So keep your eye out for it. Um, anyway, it brings me on to the star of the show, which isn't me. It isn't my picture. It is this camera. Changing the microphone. This is the Canon 1PS. No, sorry, 5D Mark II. Now, in the past, we've had great digital SLRs from Canon. But what they've done, they've done something totally groundbreaking. They've delivered a digital SLR which will give us 22 megapixels. This is to shoot up to 12,800 ISO. 12,800 of the ISO, it's amazing. But that is not the camera starting trick. What it is, it's also an HD video camera. Full 1080p, but on a full 35mm chip. No other camera in the world does that. It stunned the world when it came out. You still can't buy it. It's going to be available at the end of the month. This camera really does tear the world with up. Um, the key point is it allows you to use the specialist Canon EF lenses, which gives this great out-of-focus effect in the background. Very short depth of field, we call it. So I'm going to show you some of the, uh, some of the effects on now, uh, on a movie uh, shot by an amazing photographer, and a friend of mine from the United States, called Vincent Laforay. And Vincent, before this camera was launched, he shot a two-minute movie on it. So, we're just going to have a look at that now. Okay, so enjoy this, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we've got no sound on it, sadly, for, uh, for a couple of reasons, but uh, you just do the quality of it. this quality out, it is astonishing. And look at the out of focus effects you're getting, the very short depth of field. So what you're getting is feet out of focus with space is in sharp. You can't get that with an ordinary video camera because the depth of field that's using a much smaller chip and a much smaller f-stop is holding everything in focus all the way, even when you're using a quite wide f-stop. The model thing is as well, I'm going to show you the making of this uh, DVD afterwards because he used such little amounts of lighting and the lighting he did use isn't really specialist at all. It's really simple. I confidently predict that you're going to see an entire feature film shot on this camera. It's that good. I mean, look at it. This isn't even full resolution that you're looking at. Once again, look, snapping into focus, it's an effect you just don't get. It's really funny, um, watching stuff shot on ordinary video cameras after this really left me feeling a little bit disappointed. And look at it.